In this video, we will explore the top 3 best buy sell indicators on TradingView to help you optimize your Forex and day trading strategies. Our expert traders have handpicked these indicators based on their accuracy and effectiveness in generating profitable buy and sell signals. We will delve into the technical analysis of these indicators and their corresponding trading strategies. We will also provide tips on risk management to ensure your profitability in the long run. Our selected indicators include the Supertrend Indicator, Pivot Point Supertrend, and Buy Low Sell High Composite. These indicators are known for their reliability in generating buy and sell signals. We will also cover other popular trading indicators like Moving Average, Buy Sell Weight, and other trading view indicators to give you a comprehensive understanding of the market trends. If you are looking for the best trading strategy and indicator on TradingView, this video is a must-watch. Learn how to optimize your trades with the best buy sell indicator TradingView has to offer. Okay traders, in today's video let us add the third best buy sell indicator TradingView on the chart. Search for the pivot point super trend. This one right here by Lonesome the Blue. The idea behind this script is finding pivot points, calculating average of them, and like in Supertrend, creating higher or lower bands by ATR. As you can see in the algorithm, the script gives weight to past pivot points. This is done for smoothing it a bit. This buy-sell indicator trading view will definitely keep you on the trend. On the settings, we could notice that you can even add more options like to show the pivot points, show PP center lines, as well as show support and resistance. But since we are focused on just buying and selling in the market for this video, let's avoid using these options. But they are pretty good as well, as we would be doing a full tutorial on how to profit from this indicator later in the future. Now, since we noticed that this buy sell trading view indicator only keeps us on the trend, as we could notice how good it is on that, let's now add another indicator to better profit from the market. While the pivot point super trend keeps us on the trend. So go ahead and add the relative vigor index. This one by trading view. We won't be touching any of the settings, as they are perfect by default, but there are so many other tweaks that would profit you in the market depending on the type of currency pair you trade. To better make use of this strategy, we would have to add the zero cross line on the relative vigor index. So go ahead and add a horizontal line on the indicator. Make sure it's set to zero. Let's quickly go over the rules for a valid buy and sell signals. When we get a new buy signal from our pivot point super trend, we tend to enter the market only when the relative vigor index crosses below the zero line. What we mean is this, when we have the pivot point on green, we wait till we get the relative vigor index cross below this zero line. Then, at the point we see the green moving average cross above the red moving average while both RVI moving averages are still below the zero line, we enter the trade. and we see it was successful. Trading this by sell trading view indicator tends to be very profitable. As we can see here, we would have milked this long bullish trend. The same goes for this trending bearish trend. Make sure you backtest this strategy in whatever pair you want to trade it on before trading with actual money. Now for the second best by sell trading view indicator, search for the buy low sell high composite. This one right here by Zach MCC. This by sell trading view indicator has a volume measuring script. So be rest assured that you will be making a lot of profit using this indicator either as a standalone indicator or to fine tune your algorithm. There are many ways to apply this indicator to become profitable, but one of the top winning strategy is this. We would first attach a moving average onto the indicator. And how do we do that? First, we would click on these three dots, then click on the Add Indicator Slash Strategy on Buy Low Sell High Composite. When you click on that, search for the Moving Average. This one right here by TradingView. 
Click on it to add to the indicator. Now we can notice it has been attached to our buy low sell high composite and its reading is based on the buy low sell high composite indicator. For our buy sell composite, we won't be adjusting any of its settings as there is no option to change its inputs. But on the style, we would uncheck the composite. Also, for the moving average attached to it, let's adjust its settings for better trading. So bring up its settings. On the inputs, change the time frame to 30 minutes. Please note that no matter the time frame you are trading on, make sure when selecting the moving average time frame, it should be the next time frame after the current chart you are viewing. What we mean is this, we are currently on the 15 minutes time frame, so we chose the 30 minutes time frame. And if we were trading on the 1 hour time frame, then our moving average time frame would be set to 2 hours. Moving on. Now set the length to 5. And that would be all for the settings. Let's now dive into how we make full use of this indicator. It's really easy. When we have the buy sell composite above the moving average and it's on red, then we tend to only take the sell position. We take a break when the buy sell changes to green while it's above our moving average. And for our buy entry, we take a buy position when we have the buy sell indicator on green while it's below our moving average. The secret behind being successful with this indicator is this. If we trade it on this chart, our risk to reward ratio won't yield much. So to better make up to two to three times what we are risking in the market, when we identify a buy entry, we move down to any lower time frame to hunt for good entry points. Try this and thank me later. If you enjoy this, why not smash the like button and subscribe to the channel as it motivates us on the hunt for the holy grail. Let's move on. Now, for the top best buy sell indicator trading view, search for the buy sell weight. This one right here by Trent Sohoka. This indicator was initially coined to trade in the opposite direction of the trend. If there is a green light at the bottom, there is an uptrend. In this trend, the first exclamation mark is shortened. If there is a red line at the bottom, the trend is reversed. In this trend, a reverse transaction is open to the first tick. So there are many ways you can utilize this indicator for both trend followers and reversal traders. But one of the best ways I've found to use this indicator is this. Let's first modify the settings for better understanding. On the input, change this first setting to 15, the second to 3, third to 200. Then below here, change the factor to 5. And that would be all for these settings. To trade like a pro, it's actually easy. First identify when the indicator gives a new buy signal as the buy sell weight indicator gives a new green moving average. Then we would have to wait till we see at least two red labels. Look to enter your trades at the next blue label. Then ride your profit with a good trailing stop loss till you get to the end of such a trend. Exactly the opposite is true for short signals. When it changes to red, wait for at least two blue labels and enter your trades at the next red label. Also ride your profit till you get to the end of the trend with a good trailing stop loss. Do this right and watch your small accounts explode with massive profits. That's it for today's video. 
Do not forget to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.